you're going on guys the mcdactor here second tonight cost on like always pleasure to have you guys back and i was blessed my boys lou he uh hooked me up with some fenders we oui. muchas gracias papi i appreciate you my love and support and that's one point that i want to bring guys loyalty is everything money come and goes that ain't shit although we needed to live but the way that we treasure our friends and that we carry on and the good and the bad times that goes forever with that being said don't burn your bridges if you got good friendships don't screw that up for nothing because friendship nowadays is rare they get solid you know what i'm saying you either get snakes or you get rats or you get all that but that's the world we live now today it's a matter of just dealing with it the way we can so with that being said keep that in mind anyway today uh we're working on the civic and um like i want to say uh this ek bill is for you guys I've been doing EG Hatch, EK Hatch, EG Hatch most, most of the channel uh, assistance, so I'm going to change to different platforms. Although I have EKs in the past, you know, briefly, the Hatch show here and there, but it will be the first one that we worked on that we actually show the whole process, you know what I'm saying? So I'm pumped. Um, I show you guys the new friend that my boy just brought me today. He blessed me with that again, gracias. And um, yeah, I didn't waste no time. He blessed me big time with that. We're working on getting some other parts for the car. So we'll see how things go a little by little. It was the old fender. Could have fixed it. But one too many dents. I mean if you don't have it and you gotta fix it, why not? You could take it out and just fix it with a plastic mallet. I mean it's just gonna be a little filling. Now if you wanna do a clean build, this is the way to go. Cause right now there's no bundle. So the more parts that I put on the car with less bundle, the clean of the bill, the more money the car is going to revenue. It's a clean ass bill. And that's what I'm trying to do in this car. Even though the car looks like shit. I know you guys might see it like, what a fucking crap. But give me a chance. By the time that we're done with it, you guys see. I guarantee you it'll be B Serious 5 speed. I don't know about no motor. You know, if I had money, I would have thrown like an EV turbo it just to swing the deal. But um, yeah. Guarantee you once I be swap it, do the body change, cool over, all the paint over and all that stuff. I guarantee you I get 28, 3200. So we'll see down the road how that goes. Time, right, boys. As you guys see daylight savings is going away. It's October, so most Halloween. Don't get discouraged. This is a lemon in everybody's eyes. But if I don't start working on it, it's never going to be the gem that I'm looking for. So therefore, waste no time, put in as much work you can on your build, much effort, with whatever you have and abilities, and you'll get it done within time. So with that being said, let me get this fender on, and we'll do the other door. Fender on, lined up, door is back on, like nothing happened. We can move on and do that side, install that door, so let's get it. And there you go, boys. Speaking of my boy, Lou. That's all you guys see what I'm talking about friendship. Treasure your friends and your brothers to the end of the world. We were speaking last night in F, F Big that I was looking for parts to buy. Now he just blamed me with your defender. Well, he blamed me with two doors, bro. I mean, by the way, he's the owner of the YEG hatch that I did on the channel, if you guys don't know.
Nice border, dude. Nice border. Not worried about the color. The color is going to paint it. The same as the fender. Close the door. Have a window. Have a door handle. There's a question. Alright, by the way, when I took out the fender off camera, I fixed my fender, boys, with a mallet. The little dents, I fixed it up. Still got one more that I'm going to knock out right now, but it's going to be straight up good enough. The both fenders look good. Both doors are good. Both fenders are good. So we good morning, we can proceed with the rest. Not too bad. Still got a tie in the bowl here. That's why it looks like that. So you gotta put the 10 millimeter there. We good. Overall, look at the fender. Nice and straight. Besides that little rust, which I could sand it and fill it in. That's nothing. So straight, so good. But check out the door. Thanks to my boy Lou. Which I didn't have a window. I just needed the window, but he brought me the whole door. The other one was cratching here, so it's nice and straight now. That looks fucking amazing. Couldn't ask for more. So, we big shout out to you, my friend. That should look good, thanks to you. Even though it's a different color, not worry about it. Nice and straight. New window, we golden. So, we got that side knocked out. We obviously got this side knocked out. Doors look good. Fender look good. Last thing I'm gonna get is another hood. And this one, like I've seen better days. It needs a lot of work and I'm not gonna do much to it. So we're working on another hood down the road. For now, it's not an optical. I go with switch it. That's like the main part that I needed to do. And then we have this one and we're done with this. Top of the morning. We're going over some work in the car. We was finished yesterday. You guys seen the doors and the fenders, everything is lined up. I'll show you a little bit in the minute. But first I wanted to show you my new trip is win for the EK. It's finally finalized. Check out the last look. Of course we gotta get painted, stickers, and all of that. But that's the final look guys. Check it out. These are gonna be available, 325 a piece. No chipping included. A chip worldwide. We have for EG, Del Sol, RX7 FB. Now we got EK Hatch. Yeah, she's not looking bad. One of my friends, Hatch, is hooking it up. So he needed the three P's. We made for his EK about six, seven hundred dollars, boys. That just mocked up from tape. We tape right now because still gotta get painted. We possibly gonna carpet wrap it. But um yeah. 
Make sure you guys the progress. I wanted to surprise you in this same video. And um show you some progress, but it didn't happen like that. Show you why. I was off camera taking parts so that I could do a, a part out. So the engine was close to coming out. We got both axles out. Um Pretty much all the screws loose. The only screw that I have to take out is the top mounts of the motor, top mounts of the transmission. That's it. And it should come off. I was trying to take it off, you know, pretty much everything was ready. But in the process of working there yesterday, I have my uh, socket there. 22 socket with a ratchet I'll show you guys what happened let's see if I can find it should be something over right here oh see, I can't seem to find it this is the axis house to probably prove you guys what I was talking about this side is out that one is loose, but it's not out. Like I was trying to explain, I have the 22 socket here with a big torque wrench, about three foot. So I climb here, walk on my feet, and I just started putting some pressure, some weight on it. And the wrench just started bending. So what happened was, it snapped, boys. Once that shit snapped, I have my hands here. And wow. Yep, your boys had a commission now. For two weeks, can't do nothing. As you guys see, sorry about the dirty fingers. Cut all three fingers. This one is still bleeding a little bit, it's like a surface cut. This one was a little cut. Yeah, and this middle one, eight stitches, boys. Cut from here to here, super deep. All of me came out like you could say. I had stitches in the past in my palm and my finger close to lose it, but son of my god, that shit hurts. From the injection to the stitches. That doctor made me fucking scream. There ain't no other way to put it. But shit that happened. So just be careful in life, take your time, and enjoy the things you do. Alright, so this video is totally gonna be way different. I'm gonna have to wrap it short because of the hand injury. So I will see you guys in a couple weeks. We'll do a follow up here and there in the garage. I can't use my hand too much, so it won't be no really detailed videos. It just be like follow up on things. Hope it was a video of your liking and your tasting. One again, apologize. I usually don't do this, but duty calls. Hope this is something that. We could all understand and relate. Uh, and while we're here, we got the wing, of course. Hopefully, something you guys like the concepts for the future. Keep it in mind. And the fabs, we got you. Thank you for watching. Subscribe and like and comment. Peace. You have to find out what makes you excited. What makes you want to get up each morning and go to work? You have to find it. If you love what you do and dedicate yourself to your work, then you will gain momentum. The word momentum. You will gain that momentum. And each success will create another. In order